Hello and welcome to Feast of Pilgrims, the Thief 2 20th Anniversary uh, at Contest Mission by Random Taffa and Marble Man. I'm quite looking forward to this, I've certainly enjoyed uh, Marble Man's first mission from a couple of years ago, Cracks in the Glass. I'm interested to see what uh, he and Random Taffa have got put up, uh, put together here. So let's begin. We give thanks for our bodies, for they carry our burdens. We give thanks for our burdens, for they are the force forge of sturdy spirit. We give thanks for the forge, which is soaked by our brothers. And we give thanks to the builder, by whom we find rest in purpose, the prayer of Saint Resto. Tonight is the annual feast of St. Ives, and the Hammerites are observing the eponymous cathedral with an all-night sermon from Father Ira. Come this nail with me. Strike! Strike! Real fire and brimstone type stuff, no doubt, inspired by his recent recovery of one of their earliest relics. The Chalice of Restor was found far to the south in a forgotten shrine not far from Shirak. Long ago, it was said to grant St. Restor's boon to any pilgrim who drank of its blessed water, restoring their vitality and enabling them to complete their pious journey. The cup is priceless. Unless you've got a good fence, that is. St. Ives houses one of the most impressive libraries in all the city, complete with a restricted section that contains a reliquary where the artifact is on display. Naturally, this is off limits to the layman, so the place is rigged with an alarm system similar to Craig's Cleft. Hammerites from all around the city will be attending tonight's mass, but they'll be drawn to the nave to hear the sermon, so security should hopefully be light with the massive influx of the Builders faithful, triggering the alarm would be ill-advised. Intruder! Beware an intruder! I guess I'll have to figure out a way to slip past or disarm it. I only need access to the upper floors, so I'll be taking the Thieves' Highway. Just have to head north, and I can either loop around from the east or west to gain access to the roof. In addition to the cup, They've also brought back a few old maps pilgrims once used to journey to the tomb of St. Eldon. Nobody knows exactly where the tomb lies, but it's said to house many treasures, so I might as well snag it for a rainy day. It's almost time for mass. I'd better limber up. Alright, so we're not playing as Garrett, we're playing as Connell, and uh, judging by the uh, talk of the maps uh, to the to where the Shrine of St. Eldrick was, this seems like it's a uh, prequel to uh, Godbreaker, uh, which is when I actually went to that shrine. Alright, um... Let me just double check. No super bonus objective, sorry. Right, let's stick with hard. Use the rooftops to make your way to St. Ives Cathedral and steal the Chalice of Restor. The Hammerites also recovered valuable pilgrimage maps, which may lead to great treasures. Make them yours. It's a warm night, so that means plenty of open windows. Get at least 3,000 loot. The innocent need not suffer. Don't kill any unarmed civilians. After you're done, make your way back to your hideout. And a shop. Sell some cash, that's a lot. What's, what's this one? Radisson's contracts. Some side contracts offered to you by your contact Radisson cost free. Well, well sure. <clears throat> so what else? What do I need? Um, let's go with one health and two flash to begin with for uh, dealing with trouble. Gives us a 350. 
Yeah, shadow is too expensive. Invisibility is too expensive and not useful enough. Um, rope arrows. I've got two. Should probably be enough. I've got six water arrows. A couple more wouldn't hurt. Maybe we get another flash bomb or another healing potion. I think another flash bomb. They're generally more versatile. And you know, my aim is always not to get hurt. Oh, let's just stock up on water. Oh, wait, moss. Mm. Get one more moss. Now oh, water. Alrighty. Time to head out. Who left, left some rats in my... Uh, Hide out here. They're never open. Everyone always puts... I don't understand it. So many designers like to put these ladders leading to lofts and then... Functional ladders and non-functional... Non-functional loft doors. Wow, Connell, you're feeling... You're sounding quite old and tired there. Are you sure you're gonna... Be able to... Make it across the rooftops? Alright, so let's check the map. Whoa. So, we're here. We have about a bazillion places to explore along the way. Visiting Romero's armory might prove useful. Just over here. And there's the cathedral. Silver Smoke District. Uh, stick to the rooftops, just a big note. However, um, the readme made clear that unlike Life of the Party, which is obviously a uh, somewhat of an inspiration for this mission, the mission won't end if you make it, if you manage to make your way down to the streets. But you might not be able to make it get back up again. So, and given the size of the mission, I'll probably won't multiple uh, hard saves. There was someone patrolling there a second ago. Did they go inside? Hmm? Hello? Yes, they did. Oh, that door is not a door. Well, I hope they don't find me here. Turn around, man. Or don't. Just walk past me is also good. Oh, I see an open window over there. standing there. I'm gonna wait for him to come out again so I can go inside without him necessarily looking at me. Can't tell which way he's facing, so if he's facing away it'd be fine. If he was facing towards the door it would be rather too hazardous. What do you know I've started the last mission with uh, several Benny Hill chases climaxing in death. I don't want this one to Start quite so poorly. Not a door. A door. Help! Help! Uh, what are you? Who? Why aren't you asleep on this? This night. Actually, let's just put him. Let's put him further up. If I'd seen that first, I'd been right, but I didn't. <sighs> no loot, but uh, another way all across the rooftops. Anything on that shelf? <sighs> I 
it's uh, uh, straining himself so so hard. So uh, there's this building it connects across there and up there. Well, we've got. Let me look at this section. I kind of want to clear the whole city. Do I? What's our objective? Get back to where we started. Uh, no, let's not clear the whole city then. Let's do... It's kind of a... It looks like kind of buildings separating it here, maybe. Let's wander around this western side. Armor's armory should have some more staff, so getting out early would be good. Let's try to explore this western side, then hit the cathedral. It looks like I can get, maybe get into the cathedral there. I don't know if I can get out on this side. Um, and then come down the eastern side, explore that, and come back to the start. So let's not go back to this archer. Let's go out to the west or the north. Let's aim to come back in that door, in that window. Uh, or, hmm. <laughs> Maybe I take back what I said. I'm not sure I can get up there. I can try. And break my neck. So there's people yelling everywhere. Oh, I can't walk up this. This is this is the texture that's normally slippery by default. Oh, hello. It's not a door, it looks like a door. Well, if they're both patrolling your circle, that's quite convenient. So I'd always like to check up on things. Ah. Can't turn off some music there. Not loot. going on out there. Some commotion, but uh seems to be nothing to do with me. Now this room doesn't seem to have a light switch. Tamusian cycle, a chronicling of ancient gods. Oh, there's an upstairs. What's that? Oh, that's just the music thing. Alrighty. 
This fireplace is quite bright. But, uh, Yeah, it was a good comeback there. Someone behind me? No, in front of you. Alright, I mean, as usual, the conversation would be a good opportunity to get past people, but. Uh... So, where does, where does he wander off to? lamps be switched off? It's very, very tapper friendly. Wait, this is the window he hides in. He comes and sits in. If there's any way to turn the lights off in the whole room or just the lamps. Don't see a light switch for the room. Traveler's Guide to Silver Smoke. everything in this house. Does appear to be. Can't quite lean over this railing, it's a bit too high. Oh, he wanders different ways, okay. Let's not get too complacent then. that open window. Which takes me further west, that's fine. Judging by the size of the mission, three hours is going to be, yeah. Well, the size of the mission appears to be. Hoping for three hours does not seem very likely. 
Don't it look this way? I should have gone where he was walking out. There's someone else in there too. Kumli reset the code again. We won't find out what it is until tomorrow unless you want to run over to his apartment. But I wouldn't do that if I were you. Oh, oh yeah, we're already in Fort Romero. Where's Kumli's apartment? I mean, it's probably not marked on here, right? Let's go. into anything. It's just your imagination. Uh, I, knew, I knew one of these had to have a, a joke. Wait a minute. Alright, he's going to be hard to Get past. I think I can get around. Hmm. Hello. Strange. Thought there was something there. Next person I catch drinking on the job will be made to clean my apartment. I enjoy a pretty clear view of the place from here, so don't bother. <sighs> ah, it's way too long for a quick readable. Uh, so his apartment's nearby. So uh, maybe there or here, or I guess we'll go try and find this captain and come back. I had a bit more time than I thought I did. Didn't know how long this guy's patrol was. I didn't want to risk him uh, walking in on me. <clears throat> Lovely corners you got here. Nice and dark. Don't bother being sneaky. Right, nothing there. I'm sure we're gonna try and go out the north, out that door there, once he comes back in. You know, this, this place is quite dense with patrols, it's uh... They're good, they're, uh, they change up, they've got wait times. It's not exactly trivial to ghost, but it's certainly doable. All right, let's, let's not hang around here for long. We'll come back out. All right, let's go. Oof. 
try doing it this way. Oh. Ouch. Well. Let's go out in there. Is there anyone down here is the question. Yes. Hello. Someone there. I don't seem quiet enough now. Oh, okay, I could have come down here. Didn't notice that at all. Is he stuck or what? Oh, there he is. Nope, didn't know if he's still lying around. Let's try that window again. Job woodworking. Come on, quick. Someone there. Well, find you soon enough. Ah, bollocks, he's on me. Stay still, Connell. Stay still. <sighs> Must have been so he has a key to this to this door. Ah, oh, he's gonna be he's gonna be a nuisance, isn't he? And lots of uh, guards and very few shadows. Still. Uh. I do kind of want to try uh, continuing to ghost a bit while, while it's going alright. Knocking this guy out would be easiest, of course, but uh, if I wait for him to walk out, then rush the desk. the time. That's right, it's better to underestimate the time available than overestimate. Hopefully you won't see me here again. It's pretty dark, it's just on the edge there. I think if, it, if he'd been... Uh, Yeah, so he saw me move a fraction there. I can't read those. I wanna, wanna check out the little dead end he's down at in case there's something down there. And then we go back out that window to where there's yet another archer. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Nope, it's just a non door, alright. I've got to wait for him again. Patient Colonel. You don't get uh, you don't get to be an old thief by being a bold thief.
idea. This is... No, you didn't see anything. Luckily, I saw the ladder in time, or I would have been in a spot of bother. Is there anything else down here? Just a corner I can't move around. Oh, yes, there is. Hello. Always look up. Jump. Hello. Show yourself. It's no one. Nothing. Nothing here now. Well, that's gonna be fun getting back down. All right. Well, this is not Captain. What's his face's apartment? Clearly. They. Dead. Smuggler's package. Okay, so they're a smuggler apparently. Where does this take me? I don't know, but if I go down there, I'm not sure I can get back up. That's looking north again. Uh, we went into the woodworkers. Well, we were. Hang on. Where am I now? Let's see if I can... What's this place look like? There's a roof running east-west. There's another one running north-south. Fairly large open space. Maybe if in here? Looking out this way. Hard to say. But we're getting further and further from Fort Romero, so I think we I think this must be the apartment building we need to get into. So maybe come back this way if it looks like a good way forward. I could try breaking these boards, but would it do anything? Except alerting this guy outside. Oh, hello. Mines. There aren't any set here, are there? <laughs> Besides... Well, this is bad. I can't uh, crouch here. Alright. That time, uh, it mantled me right under the window. Alright, let's see if I can make it back onto my rope without dying here. Let me reload that. Well, he didn't hear me, so... Alright, let's not reload. Sneak around them, is there? But we need to see if we can get out to the north. So, this is the woodworking place, yeah. So, maybe. Oh, I don't know. Like, one of them is clearly drunk and singing, but, uh, doesn't mean he's too drunk to fight. Clearly the timing here was such I could have gone out, but I have to wait. Alright, Raoul. Oh, well, this must have been nothing. 
Now that he's been alerted once, he is noticing me each time. Thankfully, not enough to... He turns around there, doesn't he? Yeah. Thankfully, not enough to actually uh, be properly alarmed. Whereas, before he, when he was still uh, completely oblivious at the start, was uh, good enough for him to not see me at all. But he's woken up a bit now. Uh. <coughs> now wait for this guy, because we're going to find a way north across, across the gap. see one. I can at least wait here and follow him for a little more uh, looking time. <laughs> You've gone. He's around there somewhere. I'm closing in, Tapper. Oh, the one upstairs has been, has been alerted by the shouts as well. Alright, well, problem solved. So. Oh, hell. So there's a party going on down there. supposed to get down there because it's not a, actually not a door I think um, yeah so my plan was to try and get into that building thinking that's the one but maybe it's not the right one it's supposed to be an apartment building overlooking the place overlooking this place so if it's not that one Could be this one with knob and job, but it's definitely not. Hmm. Because the only place I could get to in there was knob and job. Uh, well, well then. I think the rooftop over this way was a bust. It's not going to be the Pembroke Estate, so I guess we do go this way after all. I'm trying to avoid the uh, rooftop. Or the people on the rooftop. Oh, he's got a key on him. Which saved me some lockpicking. There's something here. No, I will not show myself. Alright, guess we come back up here then. Okay, 
Jeff O'Connell. Or you'll uh, break more than just your legs next time. No, nope, there's all my healing. Yeah, this is awkward. Alright, so I guess we try dropping down onto these pipes and not killing ourselves. Well, success. Might not be uh, quite as nimble as it used to be, but it's still good enough. Well, that's that roof there, okay. Oh, hello, I see an open window. Which is east of here. Um, which is this building. Seems likely to be the one the captain's in, doesn't it? I don't have anything on them, do they? But... Oh, they're not singing. up in that room. I didn't even read these contracts. Why not do it now? Connell, I got me a few jobs you might take a shine to while you're out and about silver smoke tonight. First job comes from some watchwoman. She came in civ clothes, but I knows me a couple when I see them. At first I thought she was sniffing me out, but the job seems legit. She wants us to get some special grape seeds from a local gardener. She don't know where he lives, but she says he grows his shit right here in the city. My intuition tells me you should look for a greenhouse. An odd bird, this one. Seems she don't like getting her hands dirty in anything but her garden. Second got me a bit of a smuggling job. One of Davidson's insiders at the Western Warehouse was supposed to move some spice through a shipment to Blackbrook, but disappeared with the goods. The captain don't think he'd turn goat, but he's missing. He's supposed to have a secret stash not far from the warehouse, some secluded place. There's a shipping crate waiting for you near the big bay doors. Can't miss it. If you can recover the goods, stash them in there and lock it up with the key from the manager's office. Uh, that's, the smuggler, that's the smuggler's package we got, I think. All right, so uh, warehouse, we drop it off and lock it up, okay? Lastly, you heard of these new religious upstarts called the Mechanists. They say it's some hammer splinter group obsessed with machinery. Word is that one of the bright young inventors, some kid named Karras, made some sort of mechanical eye one could use as a spyglass of sorts. Well, I knows me someone who might be interested in it, but don't believe such a thing exists. Check that little workshop not far, not far from St. Ives and see if the rumour is true. Good luck, Reticen. But, but I've already got it. Look, I consume. All uh, right, so that's given me uh, three uh, objectives. And I guess this one's describing drop the smuggled goods. I've already found them and it's recognised that. All right, good. That's a nice. That's a nice way of doing uh, bonus objectives. Well, optional, more difficult ones. Can I even get in there? Oh, hello. Another ladder. All right, once the archers go by, I'll try that. See, there's no... There's no wood anywhere near that window, so even if I can get in there from some other direction, I can't get in on this side. Oh, the archer's got money on him. Hang on, then. I'm not going to rush down the ladder quite so quickly. So 
wait for another round. See if I can't nab it. <coughs> Good job. Coming north, so we're at the west west side warehouse. All right, let's try this apartment building then. And then we can drop the smuggled goods off at the warehouse. So I hear a guard there. There he is, just staring out the window. No, stairwell. Anything in the sink? Oh, something valuable. Right there. Nothing in the sink. Any guards up here? In midnight in Merkbell. Is that suspicious or just textured? Oh, what? Hey, what was that noise? What are you doing coming up here? Come in here, you're getting walked on the head. I hope you know that. I think he's getting away again. Maybe. Yeah, I don't like it much either, mate. What error? Nice. He's going. Oh, there's an upstairs here too. I didn't see that. Whoops, I didn't mean to eat that. Hmm. Ah, so he come he patrolled up here as well. Oh hello. <laughs> so one of these could be Captain What's his name's apartment, but uh, it's unclear. Okay. 
I should bright. Since I'm gonna have to dodge around him here somehow. Check out the other one. Might as well use the free water arrow I got. The tail was so held in. Right now, in here, quietly. here at least. So is this not then this is this house, this building. It's big dormer windows. It's very nice. Very nice dormer windows. But then this isn't, I guess, the captain's apartment. So where is the captain's apartment? Switch. <coughs> take a look at that. Yeah, take a look at that. Uh, all right. Well, I'll wait till he comes in here and goes upstairs, and then I'll guess I'll jump out the window. Because uh... oh, this is that an open window there. Yeah, so I can get out to the east. Alright, so that'll take me here. Maybe that'll connect into this building. I don't know. Let's find out. Well, I'm waiting. Uh, key in manager's office, shipping crate near big bay doors. No, oh, be sure to leave the key where you found it. Yes, I'll leave on that. Start tap dancing. All right, finally. Ages. Oh, where the hell am I now? Uh, map. Came east to where in here, I guess. So I want to loot this place, obviously, but I also want to see if I can get out to the south first. Oh, 
snore very loudly. If I cut that banner down, they will hear. I didn't miss a window there, did I? Magma crystal? What? It's a magma crystal. Is that in the contract? Uh, no. Something else entirely then. Unless the contracts are randomized, which would be yeah, quite a nice touch. Then you'd think the objectives would match. Yeah, there's no, there's no way out here unless. What's that? Help! Someone! You didn't hear anything, did you? Oh wait, he's gonna see it. Even though she was already there. Can't just leave her there. I don't think we can just. Not sure these corners are dark enough either. Well, this is awkward. Let's hope that's dark enough. So now where? I call upon the elements to smite you. Oh sh shite, you did see me. I have eternity to seek you out. Just looking out the window. The intruder eludes me for now. Darkness shall overtake you. Do you see death? In the darkness. Someone else is a was it now. Where am I going from here? The eternal fire will reclaim you. Just you wait till I find you. Oh, now he's a little earthen too. Bloody windows. Uh, right, so... This is no good. Seems like a dead end. I'm gonna knock him out so that I can, uh... God, everyone else is yelling. It seems like uh, this one incident has woken everyone in the whole building. What? Who? Is there another door there? And why do you run out here and guards stand here Wait. shivering? Don't let him get away. Guards. <clears throat> Quiet. Can 
not be outrun. Be still. So there's at least another mage around as well. I must have missed a door. You cannot escape the inevitable. Well It's a redundant kind of statement, isn't it? If it's inevitable then by definition it's not escape. Your fate is a hurricane that cannot be outrun. It's a very nice metaphor. Your fate is a freight train that's about to hit you on the back of the head. What? The eternal fire will reclaim you. I have eternity to seek you out. I have eternity. Well, no, I have a few more minutes till the end of the episode to uh, wait for you to calm down. Now, here's my problem. He's alert enough that he sees me just standing there. Well, it's pretty dark here, but it seems like it's not dark enough for him to escape his notice. Maybe I just need to wallop him on the head. Let's try it. Let's just let's just see. Oh, what a mess! Look at this. All right, it's dark enough. Dark. Ah. Yeah, whatever. All right, that. You don't have anything on you, do you? Valuables? No, no. <clears throat> don't know what kind of establishment you run here, but. Uh... So it doesn't even cut, okay. Well, uh, that was a fine how to do. Right. Well, I think I'll leave them to their uh, snoreless sleep, snoreless sleep, snoreless sleeping without snoring. And uh, seems like a decent place to end the episode. Um, take a break for five minutes. When I come back, we'll uh, go see where these people arrive at in the other room, which I thought was dead end, but is apparently not. So thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next episode.